they people are looking for a character named ashok tara ashok tara was a major in 1970 and uh, he rescued the family when uh, they were confined in the house of uh, mujib sahab so it was a great opportunity as well as it was a great character to play and i was thinking like i'm going to be a part of history so i guess this match talking about the shooting experience you shoot the film in uh, india as well as bangladesh by shooting in bangladesh how was the you know about the people over there and about how uh, you responded to the film yes uh, actually i was looking to go uh, bangladesh but uh, due to covid conditions it was not possible so we did shoot in film city i shooted in film city for two days and uh, definitely it was very wonderful when i come to know that people were loving the character of ashok tara as uh, arfin shubhu the lead character mujib who was playing mujib he told me that people were amazed watching that uh, um, the pakistani army uh, soldier was putting banner here uh, just uh, on my chest and i was pushing him through my chest even when the banner was piercing through my uh, ribs and my lungs so it was a kind of um, uh, courageous gesture i'm very thankful to mr sham rawat who did cast me for this character and uh, mr sham koshal who suggested me to do this uh, this way that uh, the person is coming the pakistani soldier is piercing he's trying to piercing uh, the panet through my chest and i'm pushing him like this so it was his uh, call and uh, mr sham koshal said that it will look very fantastic on screen you trust me and do it and i just followed the instructions started your career in television industry i mean uh, sang was a major road you take yeah how did you started the journey initially what was the inspiration and what were the challenges you faced mm, actually i came to mumbai in 2013 and earlier in t- uh, 2007 i started my career as an actor earlier i was practicing for theater then for uh, tv series then film so uh, when i came to, to uh, uh, when i came to bombay in 2013 i feel like i should try something new but i want to increase uh, step by step i want to do it gradually it should not be like one day i did a fantabulous movie and second day i am doing something not that worth of so i tried start from zero so i first i worked as a theater artist in some unprofessional theater company and then uh, we went to bna bna is bhartendu natya academy in up lucknow and uh, after that when i came to when we went to uh, uh, then we went to srft satyajit ray film and television institute in 2012 because i am t- uh, 2010 and 2012 i was in bna working as an actor so when i came to bombay it was like i am just stepping up first non professional theater then professional theater then bna training then i started from cid shapath kind of episodic uh, shows and uh, when i come to know in 2017 that they people are casting for uh, mere sai on sony channel i was feeling like okay this is the right time to take this kind of decision because first of episodic then continuity lead in our dd show then on z zindagi then uh, big magic and now it is sony so i was just climbing up gradually so when i got this opportunity i was uh, scared i was feeling like it's a very sacred and very big character and it took it will take definitely a lot of a lot of experience a lot of believe in sai baba my mother is sai baba's devotee so she was very happy that you are going to do this character but i was saying i'm not interested because it's a uh, definitely it's a once a lifetime opportunity but you will have to put heart and soul so uh, i was feeling because most of the time it happens in india people is uh, people are doing some mythological character some uh, periodic kind of character and they are stuck so i was scared but uh, then i talked to my mom and i said uh, like uh, sai baba maybe sai baba is calling me in 2016 i bought a house in bombay and uh, my mom came here and uh, she asked me to uh, go to uh, shirdi i took him and uh, there i just wished like a kid she was forcing me she was insisting me come inside the temple and it was very crowded there at that day and uh, i said baba you can do anything 
then uh, do a miracle, make me a celebrity, arrange a red carpet for me and I will come definitely to your place. And uh, believe me, in 2016 I prayed, I, just, I was just a kid, I just uh, uh, expressed myself and it was a very funny thing. But what happened in 2017 when people called me and they said we auditioned for thousand actors around and um, many uh, look tests they took and after that they chose me, they uh, shortlisted five people for that character and the audition went to Shirdi and the Shirdi Trust and people were, who were working there, they, they said uh, to the casting company and to the producer to the channel that this boy is the right fit for this character and they called me up. I was not that much interested but Baba bless me and I did that character. But after working in the TV industry, how did the breakthrough came to the films? I mean, or initially you got break, is it Nuzi for the initial breaking or before that also you got something? Actually, uh, I did a very short character in Adil Mushkil as well. But uh, uh, things were narrated in a different way. But it's God's wish. Uh, I was not that much visible in the movie. Uh, then uh, I started in television. I became Mere Sai. Then uh, when I left the show, I, I was out and was looking for a career in film. So Mr. Shyam Rawat, who is basically the casting director of the film, he called me up and he said, I saw one of your pictures from Facebook and uh, you are looking very impressive in that and I want to meet you. So I went to their office in uh, town and uh, I asked them, Ki, sir, how you come to know? He said, I saw your picture and uh, I want you to introduce to Mr. Shyam Benegal. Uh, Benegal sir was there and Mr. Shyam Rawat really pushed so hard and he said, uh, I have seen your attire, you look very good in army's uh, costume and uh, uniform is looking very nice and uh, uh, he is a Punjabi guy, Mr. Ashok Tara and he narrated the entire character to me and I said okay fine sir, would love to do it. I was uh, having goosebumps because uh, Mr. Sham Menegal just standing beside me and he said uh, as Jon Snow was that uh, was not that big character in the, f in the web series Game of Thrones but it was a very important character. So Ashok Tara is not the lead of the film, Mujib obviously is because the movie is the biopic of Mr. Sheikh Mujibur Rahman but it is a very important character. So would you love to? So I said of course sir if you believe me and you feel like I can play the character like Jon Snow in Game of Thrones definitely it's an honour and I'm gonna do it. And being part of our TV industry I mean an artist has to go through a lot of things. Yep. Sometimes you know there's a change of character. Sometimes uh, there's a payment issue or sometimes it happens like that uh, the show TRP are not good though it's off here. So what you have to take say on that? A very nice project Ms. Deep. How did you grab this project and how was working in this project and about the director is a legendary I mean, what do you say? Uh, first of all thank you so very much uh, to the media team especially your channel and uh, respected Mr. Shyam Benegal. Actually, they people were casting for the film and uh, definitely it was a uh, it was a great opportunity, once a lifetime opportunity for anyone. Iski awaaz aari hogi, galat hai ye.